This training is about the importance of supporting career diversity. Research shows that words have a powerful impact on people in terms of how they act, think, and feel. Terms like alt-academic, alt-ac, and non-academic, non-ac careers can send negative messages to individuals who are pursuing careers beyond the academic job market. Such terms present a false choice and do not account for career diversity and mobility within and across career sectors over time. When engaging with students about careers, consider using specific career field or career sector terms during the conversation instead of more generally referring to anything that is not within academia as alt-ac or non-academic. Instead of, how is your alt-ac job search going? Consider saying, how is your job search going in science policy? When talking about job search, include language that does not refer to only one job market. Many students search for jobs among different career fields at the same time. Instead of, when are you going to go on the job market? You can consider saying, when are you going to start looking for jobs and in which career fields? It is equally important to be diligent when reviewing our written materials and visual images. Do these also reflect a commitment to career diversity and inclusivity? What if a presenter is coming to campus and has titled their presentation, Career Tips for PhDs Looking at the Alt-Ac Job Market? Here too, we can have a role in shaping language that incorporates career diversity and can ask the presenter to use a phrase that is more inclusive. Perhaps the new title could be, Career Tips for PhDs Looking for Jobs in Industry. In addition to using different terms and phrases to reflect an acceptance of career diversity, it is important that our visual world also reflects different types of successes and opportunities. Consider the success stories that you might feature on your department's website or the images of successful alumni that appear in your hallways. Quite simply, do they reflect career diversity? Do they generate visions of possibilities? When we attach success to acquiring only one type of job or pursuing only one career path, students will likely experience rejection, challenges in their well being, and a need to hide their true intentions and goals. This is problematic for the student, for the advisor, and for the department. There are a couple tips for promoting career diversity. First, we can remind students that their degree is one of many qualifications and reinforce that they are multifaceted and that they bring a range of skills, knowledge, and experiences to all that they do and can do. And we can contribute to a culture that engages in the values of career diversity and the types of conversations we have, the words we choose, and the stories and images of success that we share. If you are interested in learning more about the importance of supporting career diversity, please reach out to Kay Kimball Gruder, Assistant Director, Graduate Student and Postdoc Career Programs and Services. She can be reached at k.gruder at uconn.edu.